Hey there YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a custom grip tape design for your longboard. Alright, so what you're going to need is a longboard and some new grip tape. I bought this from online, and uh, but you can get it at your local skate shop if you want. Uh, make sure it's the right length for your deck, uh, so you might want to measure that first. So if you have a regular grip tape on your deck currently, this black grip tape, you're just going to take an X-Acto knife uh, or razor blade and kind of... Uh, try to get under the grip tape a little bit, and once you have that peeled up a little bit, you can start to peel off the grip tape um, off the whole deck. Uh, but since this is a loaded uh, longboard, uh, loaded boards have a spray on grip tape, and to take that off, you can just take some uh, sandpaper and sand down the deck to get it nice and smooth. You, you want it nice and smooth so that the adhesive on the grip tape will stick to the deck properly and it won't fall off. So I'm just going to start sanding down this loaded dervish and get it nice and smooth. Alright, so once you've sanded down the deck and it's all nice and smooth, I like to take some rubbing alcohol and just uh, wipe down the deck, make sure everything's all clean uh, for putting down the new grip tape. So uh, I'm just going to take some alcohol and put it on some paper towels and just wipe down the deck. Make sure, uh, make sure you get everything and it's nice and, nice and clean. And this just ensures that the, uh, that the grip tape adhesive is going to stick to the deck properly. Uh, without you know, without any particles, um, particles from the deck previously messing that up. All right, so once up. you have the deck nice and clean, you're going to take your grip tape and lay it down, uh, upside down, so that you can trace the outline of the longboard onto the onto the actual grip tape itself. Um, I like to turn it over so that you can get closer to the grip tape and a more accurate uh, stencil. So just take a sharpie and stencil the line onto it. Alright, so you can't really tell on video, but I have stenciled out the perimeter of the longboard. And now this is where you just take the Sharpie and do be creative, you know, draw whatever design you want. Uh, make sure that it's going to cover uh, these two areas because that's where your feet is going to go, obviously. So just, you know, do what you want. Make sure it looks cool. Alright, so I cut the grip tape in half just to make it more manageable. And then I stenciled out the design that I wanted with some Sharpie. And now just come to a nice hard flat surface so you can get a clean cut and just cut off the design that you drew on your grip tape. So here we go. So now that you have all the pieces cut out, I like to lay it out and make sure that everything fits together and it looks nice and now I'm just gonna put it on the deck uh, without pulling off the adhesive and just make sure that hey, everything's gonna fit the way I want it to alright so once you have all the pieces in the places that you want them you're just gonna take off all the adhesive and put it on the deck for the final result so here we go. Alright, so once you have all the pieces actually adhered onto the deck and all sticking, I'm just going to take a razor blade and turn the deck over and cut cut along the perimeter and just make sure that uh, there's no extra pieces sticking out like this, this, or you know, like any of this. Just make sure it's all real close to the deck. So, there we go. So this is the final product, came out really nice, I'm really happy with it. And remember if you liked the video, uh, make sure to subscribe to make sure that you'll keep updated with all the videos I'm posting. So if you liked the video, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you later. Thanks.